Hi guys, it's Stephanie again. It has been a little over a year since I have posted anything on YouTube um, after my surgery. Um, as a reminder, I had the um, post-anterior and posterior fusion of the L4-S1 uh, last February, February of 2013, and um, basically it failed. I don't know. I'm 100% worse. Um, since surgery. I now have pain going down my left leg, which is the sciatic nerve. Um, I have a hard time walking, standing, sitting, doing anything. I tried to return to work after my surgery, um, like four months after surgery, and um, couldn't couldn't do it. I couldn't work. Um, and I, I was an EMT, and I knew I couldn't go back to that profession, and so I tried just like an office job, and I just couldn't do it. I have applied for disability since then. I have gained 40 pounds since surgery, uh, which the weight is not helping my back at all. If I could lose the weight, I know I would feel a whole lot better. It's just hard. I'm on a ton of medication. Um, I'm still currently taking narcotics, and it's been a year and a half later. Um, I go to pain management. I'm getting epidurals all the time. I'm going through physical therapy all the time. I still wear my turtle shell every now and then. And in fact, um, I'm needing to meet with another orthopedic surgeon to have surgery done again. Um, and I don't think I'm going to do it because it's, the first one ruined my life. Nothing against the surgeon. He did everything correct. Um, my body just didn't handle it, and uh, maybe I didn't walk enough, or eat the right things, or maybe I pulled something. I, I don't know um, exactly what went wrong, but all I know is that I'm in pain all the time, and it hurts, and it's depressing, and, um, and I can't do anything. I had to quit living on my own, and I had to move back in with my parents. Uh, applied for disability and every day I just kind of try to find a hobby and um, I'm miserable. It, it's really bad and if you're gonna have back surgery more power to you. I hope it works. Um, I don't I don't really know but uh, that I just wanted to update everyone since it has been so long since I've posted. It's been over a year. Uh, that's that's where I'm standing right now, and uh, just waiting for disability to be approved. I go to multiple doctors. I have physical therapy twice a week. I see at least one doctor a week. Uh, the medications that I have keep me so well. I'm not really spaced out. I'm not spaced out, but it just I don't know. I don't know. It is what it is. Um, I, and I wanted to say thank you because people were actually watching my videos. And I was shocked. And like I've even had people tell me that they helped them. And I'm so glad because that's what I, I wanted to do. So that was fun. So I'm glad it helped somebody. Yay! <laughs> um, I have actually started a group on Facebook and it's um, the title of it is yeah let's see crap what is it young and young and in chronic pain and also the uh, spondylolisthesis try to look for it I'll try um, well actually in the um, description of this video I will post um, the link for that Facebook um, feel free to join it and you can see my new brace. Oh yeah, I'm getting a new brace and this one's going to be really cool. It's not going to be like the hard shell brace, but it wraps around like my lower body and then it has this pole that comes up the front and like a piece that rests along my chest and then like these straps come around the back like a backpack and like holds me up and that feels like I tried it on today and it felt so good. Like it was like I laid down to rest. Like it felt that good. Like it just let my bones and my muscles just <sighs> felt great. So now we're waiting for insurance to improve it, approve it, excuse me, and uh, then I'll get like fitted for it. And I can't wait. Uh, 
went to an orthopedist today and kind of told him, I'm like, look, you know, I have the sciatic pain. Um, it's getting worse and I'm having pins and needles. That's a new symptom since surgery um, happened late last year. But when I bend over, I have pins and needles all along the, the back, like the lower back. And when, when I stand back up, I have the pins and needles on my lower back. Um, and I've had physical therapists say, you know, oh, well, you know, well, nobody likes the pins and needles. Everybody agrees that the pins and needles should not be happening. Not a good sign. I've had some physical therapists say, you know, oh, that sounds like maybe it could be like bones pulling apart. Others say it's nerves. Um, I am on Neurotin or Gabapentin, and that is for like neurological pain, like nerve pain. Um, take um, Diclofenac. It's an anti-inflammatory. And here, here's a little something. Um, since my surgery, I've been diagnosed with fibromyalgia. I've been diagnosed with osteoarthritis, and I've been, um, I went to my doctor and I said, my bones hurt. They ache. They just hurt. And like my shin bones, I said, it feels like one of those old, old time cheese graters just going down my, my shin, just, just grating this, the, the bone. Um, come to find out I was vitamin D deficient. Um, and I think uh, normal levels is like 30 or 32. And I was at 12, I think, if not lower. Um, so I've been on 50,000 units of vitamin D a week. And I've been on that for a couple of months now. And my levels are back up. And it has helped my bone pain. So that's good. Um, but, you know, I've got the arthritis and the fibromyalgia now. And... I just, I'm 29 and I'm falling apart. So I just wanted to update everybody from my previous videos. Nothing really exciting happening in my life. So that's it. Yeah. Um, look in the description for the link to my Facebook support page. And I look forward to meeting some people uh, on my Facebook page and let me know how you are doing if you've had surgery if you're gonna have surgery if you have questions about my surgery if you have suggestions for me of anything that I could do uh, any anything I just you know I have nothing to do I have no life now so I'll be on Facebook all the time so be my friend I welcome you to my Facebook See, I'm pretty normal, right? <laughs> All right. You guys have a great night. And um, thanks again for seeing my videos before. And I'm, I'm glad they helped. Bye.